This is Mr. Williams here from the Sydney Russell School Science Department, here to tell you all about vaccines. So what is a vaccine? Well, a vaccine is a medicine that's designed to make a person less likely to catch a disease. They also help stop you from passing the disease to your friends, your family, or anyone else that you might come into contact with. They're an essential weapon in the fight against disease around the world. Incidentally, the word vaccine comes from the same root as the word vash, meaning cow, for reasons that we'll find out in just a sec. How were vaccines invented? Well, the first vaccine was created by a scientist called Edward Jenner around 250 years ago in the 1770s. A terrible disease called smallpox was killing around 400,000 people every year in Europe. Smallpox was caused by a virus. Jenner noticed that people who often milked cows would not develop smallpox. He also noticed that they would, however, develop a much less serious disease called cowpox. This gave Jenner an idea. What if the less serious disease, cowpox, was giving people a defence against the deadly smallpox? Jenner tested his idea out using a milkmaid with cowpox to infect a young boy called James Phipps. James caught cowpox but quickly got better. Six weeks later, Jenner infected James with smallpox. James didn't get sick. He'd been vaccinated against the deadly disease. We now know that the viruses that cause smallpox and cowpox are very closely related. And thanks to Jenner and his vaccine, Smallpox is now an extinct virus, with the last confirmed case being in 1977. This is all thanks to vaccines. So how do viruses hurt you? Well, COVID is caused by a virus called the coronavirus. Coronaviruses make you sick by sticking to the cells in your body using the spiky bits on the outside, which are known as spike proteins. Incidentally, the word corona means crown, and it's the spikes that give the coronavirus its name. Using the spike proteins, the coronavirus will inject your cells with genetic material, hijacking them and turning them into factories for making thousands of copies of the virus. Eventually, the cell bursts, releasing these viruses that then go out to infect more and more cells, making you more and more sick. How do vaccines protect you? Well, vaccines work by teaching your body how to fight back. The vaccine teaches your body to create its own antibodies, proteins that can destroy coronavirus. In the case of COVID, the vaccines teach your body how to recognize and fight the spike proteins, effectively destroying the virus's weapons and stopping it from being able to take control of your cells. Are vaccines dangerous? Serious side effects from vaccines are very rare. Vaccines go through testing on tens of thousands of people before they're rolled out to the public. If they're found to be unsafe, they simply aren't allowed to be used. All COVID vaccines currently in use have been through the same rigorous sets of trials on tens of thousands of volunteers and have been found to be safe. Some people might have a reaction to the vaccine, for instance, a raised temperature or maybe tiredness, but this is quite rare. The risk of falling sick from COVID and passing it on to your friends and family is vastly outweighed by the benefit of taking the vaccine. The rollout of vaccines against COVID-19 is a major step on the path to beating the disease. While young people do not often get too sick, if you're not vaccinated, you are still able to pass the disease on to people who could really suffer, like your parents, your grandparents and other people. The vaccine will help us defeat coronavirus and return to normal life. I for one will be waiting in line for my vaccination as soon as I get the call, not just to protect myself, but to protect everyone.